But first, a local family wants justice after two women are hit and killed while crossing the street early this morning. Detroit police say they have found the car, but they're still looking for the driver. The accident happened on Schaefer between Puritan and Finkel. Local 4's Larry Sproul is live at Detroit Police Headquarters for us tonight. And Larry, we know that a reward is now offered to try to catch that driver. And Sandra, an employer for, with the family member of Erica's, they are the one who is offering that reward. Now, tonight I spoke with the father and the brother, and they tell me that she never really goes and leaves the house because she's always watching the kids. So the very night that she decides to go out with their friends, it's sad to say that she's not returning home. And she got four kids. Your daughter? Yeah, and the youngest is three. The oldest is 19. And we, they, they want their mother, they miss their mother. Right now, Antonio Pickett is trying to figure out how to tell his grandkids that their mother, his daughter, is dead. It's going to be hard giving them answers. Answers, Pickett says, he just doesn't have. The last few hours have been tough for his family. After learning early Saturday morning, someone hit and killed his daughter, 38-year-old Erica Yancey, and her sister-in-law, Brittany Jones, who was in her 20s. They were both walking across this area of Schaefer after leaving this banquet hall Saturday around 2 in the morning. Detroit police said the driver was in a dark colored Kia Soul. The driver kept going. It's, you can't just do that and then go on about your day like nothing happened, you know, like it's a dog in the streets. I asked her younger brother, Antonio Pickett Jr., how he was dealing with all of this. I don't know, man. I don't have the words to explain the way I feel. I want justice more so for my, 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 niece and, my nieces and my nephew. Um, they senseless man it's just senseless and it keep going it's just like how heartless could you be i'm angry and i feel terrible zachary dickerson with proof technologies corporation also got the news about erica from her family that's why he's stepping in to help bring justice we at proof technologies are offering a five thousand dollar cash reward for any information leading to the conviction of the uh, perpetrator of this crime. So you can't run. You can think you're running, but karma is a mother. And so Detroit police, they are still looking for the driver. If you know anything about this hit and run, you are asked to call Detroit police. We are live at police headquarters tonight. Larry Sproul, look for. Yeah, just heartbreaking for the family. Thank you, Larry.